Chase thinks he needs to save the world. There's too many of them. But you don't need to encourage him to do it. Have a little faith. Are you happy with the, the look that Harold and the team have come up with for the Shadowhunters? I mean, do you like your look in this? And the... Definitely, yeah. I think there's a darkness that Harold has brought to the piece, which I think is easily lost in adaptations, particularly of YA novels. And there's a reality to it as well, which is nice. You know, it's very easy to go into fantasy land too quickly. He says, wearing a <laughs> dress, effectively. <laughs> Oh, a little bit. Well, every girl's got to have a little black dress. That's the way I look at it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> and of course, Jace and Clary, it's like this, you know, there is a romance there, but I think it's been a lot more fun to play kind of a, a very old school back and forth bickering. What I love about him is the fact that he's actually just a bit of a douchebag. Um, <laughs> he's not like he's not like a meathead. He's just he's just sarcastic and rude. Yeah. Personality-wise, Jamie is exactly like Jace. It's actually like interacting with Jace, talking to him. It's a little bit creepy. There's a lot of physicality to the role as well, which has been difficult to prepare for, absolutely, yeah. but but it's paid off, which is great. Like, not eating cookies is so hard. <laughs> so hard. So hard. Thank you, Jamie. Thank Good you so you. much. <laughs> Thanks, Best 3 a.m. interview ever. <laughs> Thank you.